How's it going, everyone? Today is Saturday, uh, March the the ninth. Man, this week has been gone so fast. But uh, this Saturday is uh, Saturday reads where I tell you, you know, what books I'm reading, what um, and what I'm reading through the Bible. Um, and also, uh, I, may, I may change up a little bit. I may talk about uh, what I've been learning through myself study um what i've been studying about and other good stuff and also some announcements if there's any but uh i did have one announcement um i have decided uh what one of my um one uh one of my brothers in christ uh he uh, he's a christian youtuber named uh joshua um Viewer, no, not viewers. Uh, something like something along from that. Uh, uh, he he uh, uh, posts on on um, on the Facebook group about you know doing one month of vlogging for the month of April, and you know I thought about it and I was like, yeah, maybe, maybe I should do a vlog in one month and see experiment about vlogging and how I you know do vlogging and stuff um but yeah so I may do that next month so stay tuned and uh apart from everything else um yeah yep okay so what so this week I'm starting to read this book called um Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. Uh, this is recommended by one of my, one of my former, um, well, back, you know, uh, uh, so somebody, somebody recommended this book. Yeah, this book is pretty pretty good book. Uh, talks about, um, you know, learning from Andrew Carnegie and how he becomes successful and rich. Uh, I mean, this this book really changed my mindset about increasing my income. Uh, I'm not saying that we should be uh, we should be wealthy. Um, you know, it's harder for the rich man to get into the kingdom of God, and so, and so, uh, my goal for for the next, I'm gonna say for the next five years, you know, uh, just increase my income by doing. Uh, you know, right now I'm trying to get it to get a certification for tutoring because uh, you know I believe that God is calling me uh, to a different career path, and uh, the Lord really wanted me to become a tutor. And 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 I did some research about how uh, how much does a tutor make a year, and it varies. It varies from. Twenty-five dollars per hour to fifty dollars per hour. They can make up to eighty thousand or more if you're running your own business, or if you're working with a tutor company, you may get up to like fifty thousand at the most. Like, yeah, it's, it's, all, it's all between there. And so I was like, wow, you know, Lord, if you want me to become a tutor. I'm going to do it for you, Lori. And so I I accepted the Lord's calling in my life, and I'll I'll become a tutor. Hopefully within a week. Uh, hopefully within a year or two. Uh, just I just need to save up some money, uh, to get training and certifications and stuff that I needed. So, so I'm enjoying this book so far. I'm reading it this this uh this evening, as well. Bible reading, um, you know, right now I'm starting over again, reading the whole entire Bible, two months, with the Holman Christian Standard Bible. Now, this is the study Bible. I'm, I'm using this one for now. Uh, I do have the, uh, the paperback version with no notes in it, just, just text uh, of scripture. But uh, I really want to use this because it's... Uh, the, the uh, the layers are very very uh, big to the point where I can see, and so uh, this morning I read uh, Numbers twenty eight 
25 through the book of Deuteronomy chapter 2. And uh, and right now I'm going through the, the gospel of Mark. And, and I think probably in the beginning of gospel of Luke. I'm not very sure. But I'm, I'm doing that, that one as well. Um, you know, I've been enjoying reading the Word of God more. Uh, you know, I, I made a goal that, you know, I should be reading more scripture than ever before. And rooms to go, just parked there. So, if you hear the truck, you know, that's what, that what it is. But anyway, um, yeah, uh, for studying... Um, uh, what's it called? Beginning of this week, I studied U.S. history. Well, trying to finishing up U.S. history, um, five, which is from nineteen no eighteen ninety to nineteen forty five in that frame. Uh, but I'm done with that, and now I'm studying uh, hermeneutics, which uh, next month I'll be taking a um. Hermeneutics and Exegesis class uh, next month, so it, it will help me to understand hermeneutics, get some practice, you know, of of hermeneutics because this class is going to be a challenge, and so I'm going to challenge myself if I know the scripture through, um, through, um, what do I say, through, you know, through different principles of, of hermeneutics and so I'm going to be doing that as well um yeah so I think that's all the update or the stuff that I, that I need to talk about um but yeah so uh starting tomorrow I'm going to be preaching my sermon which will be entitled stay pure in the in the corrupt world and uh, hope and and it's gonna be a blessing. This is, this is gonna be a powerful word Sunday. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, I hope I hope you guys have a great great uh, Saturday. And uh, yeah, so I'll see you again later.